Okay, this is the second part of the tutorial for the Wet Eden Super 3x3x8 three three Type 2. And last time I completed the whole middle band right here. Now the next thing I want to do is to get the next two layers right outside of this. So to do that, I'd first make those aligned as well. And for that, you just have to solve the whole thing like a 3x3x3. Three by three by three just so that the shape returns to normal. You don't have to worry about the exact placement of the white and yellow sides. Just try to keep the middle band intact. Okay, like that. So now I can move all of these layers individually, like this. Okay, now from here, I want to solve these, this layer here, as well as this layer here. So you can start with any one of them, it doesn't matter which. And just see which corners are correct. You want to get the corners first. So this orange and green are in the right spot. But this blue and orange is not, because it, it makes a checkered pattern here. So, since this orange and green is already working, this one cannot work either. That should go on the other side. And this blue and orange should work. So these two are correct, and I need a green and pink, or a green and purple, and a blue and purple. So look for those here. This blue and purple is on the wrong side on this layer, so it should come up here. So this one is correct. And this green and purple does the same thing, so I have to put these two up here and replace them with these two pieces. To do that, just move it out of the way at first. So these two are down here. The ones I'm replacing them with are up here. I'm going to bring them down to that side. Replace them and put it back up. Now these two corners are already in the right spots relative to each other and I just have to flip these two around. Now for this I need algorithms from the 3x3x2, 3x3x4 or other puzzles like that. So I'm going to have the two pieces I'm mixing or flipping both on the right side and I'm going to do 2R U, 2R, U inverted, 2R, 2F, U inverted, 2F, B, er, D, and 2R. Now that solves all the corner pieces. Now I just have to look out for these edge pieces in between. Just see that you have the right number of each ones, of each color. Blue, green, another blue, and an orange. I have two blues, so I just had to replace one of the blues with this pink, or purple. So I'm just gonna bring them both down to this layer. Like that. And I'm going to flip this one and this one, so that there's a purple opposite of the blue. For that, I'm going to use another algorithm from those same types of puzzles from I mentioned earlier. And this one's going to be... I have to make sure that it's in the front and on the side, the ones I'm flipping. This one will be R2, U, R2, U, R2, 2U, R2, 2U, R2, U, R2, U inverted, and R2. Now that flips them and one is opposite the other. So now I'm gonna do the exact opposite of what I did before and put those two pieces in. So now I have all the correct edge pieces here, I just had to orient them correctly. Now there's these three pieces messed up and if I flip these two I'll get at least the green side so I'll do that first. To do that I need to make them both in front uh, both of them 
in front and in the back. And since this side is already mixed up, just one spin like that, I'm going to put that on the right. So R2, U2, R2, U2, R2. And that's all those. Now there's only these two left, and I can use the same algorithm as before, where I flip just these two. And I'm, I'm going to do that right now. So R2, U, R2, U, R2, 2U, R2, 2U, R2, U, R2, U inverted, R2. And now that again messes up this side, but as long as I have an odd number of those kind of moves on this layer, it should turn out, it should turn out fine. And looking at it right now, it's actually not going to have an odd number. Which can be a problem, but I can that can easily be fixed. So same thing as before. R2, 2U, 2R, 2U, 2R. And then just flip these two. R2, U, R2, U, R2, 2U, R2, 2U, R2, U, R2, U inverted, and R2. Okay, so now this these pieces are all flipped around, so I just have to flip it like that. So in those cases, one or three of two greens or two oranges, two blues or two purples, doesn't matter which, is on the wrong side. And since they don't have an extra color, like this orange has an extra yellow, this purple has an extra... Well, that's not stickered. Or this orange has an extra white. It doesn't have anything like that. So it's hard to distinguish which one should be on the exact side. So you don't really have to worry which one exactly. As long as you flip two of the same color. And only two. So to do that, I'm going to put both of the greens on one side. I'm going to do the greens. And from here, they're front and right. I need them exactly here so I can just flip these two around using the previous algorithm. And that should work. So, R2, U, R2, U, R2, 2U, R2, 2U, R2, U, R2, U inverted, R2. Now, just make sure that everything else is in the exact spot as before, and put it back in. And that automatically solves it. 